everybody welcome back to our channel today we are getting things at michael's that i wasn't able to get at our last outing um when we went to dollar tree and kroger in one of our last videos i believe it was i think our last video and then james and then um i had to get my dad a father's day gift men are so hard to get gifts for so um, I think <laughs> I think I'm gonna go to Academy, um, but, but there is a Coles right there. So I don't know. I just don't know what to get, guys. <laughs> They're so hard to shop for. But um, yeah. So but I'll have to do this all in like 45 minutes because Hannah is taking a nap, and David can't pick her up because he just had a back injection today, and he's not supposed to pick anything up in like more than like. 10 pounds so i gotta hurry so all right here we go <laughs> I got at Michael's just really quick and sorry I have the air conditioner on um, on blow sorry if you can hear that and not me very well but it's well it says 97 degrees but I think it's supposed to be you're supposed to feel like 103 so but I'll just go ahead and show you what I got real quick here instead of waiting until I get home got some rocks that I got I'm doing do some an activity well I can go ahead and tell you because this will come out after Father's Day it's a Father's Day activity I'm going to use. So, these are rocks. Um, and then I told you, I think it was the last vlog, that I had to use a, uh, that I didn't didn't know where my glue gun was. I got a mini glue gun because the glue I bought at Dollar Tree was mini. So that's what I got. Then I bought two basic frames because I got, I'm going to be using those too. All right, now I'm going to run over to Academy and try to find my dad a gift. I had 20 minutes before Hannah is supposed to wake up from her nap. She may have to stay in her crib a little bit longer than she usually does. But we'll, we'll hurry. All right, I was not successful with finding my dad a gift, but we did get James a Marshall Swim trainer life jacket so when we will go to the lake this weekend he will have a life jacket a new one so we that's was successful so it wasn't a total bust at academy so that means that we'll just have to get out again tomorrow but i am going to go home and i am going to cook a healthy ramen stir fry so you want to stay and watch that if you're interested all right let's go all right so i had to stop by walgreens and pick up a picture and actually <laughs> i found i ended up finding my dad a couple little gifts i have a hero for i call my call him dad and and then this is like a little pin set. The pin, he plays golf or he likes golf. And it includes a bag with black, red, and blue ink. The, the little uh, clubs or pins. How cute is that? And then I saw these. I thought David would like these. And then I, I got some Father's Day cards too. Because I bought David a, a card, but I didn't buy anybody else a card. So. I think that'd be enough for my dad because then I'll have like the kids buy, make him something so I won't have to get out again tomorrow to buy him something else. We are actually 41 minutes late to pick up or to wake up Hannah from her nap. Hannah, sorry Hannah, we are on our way. <laughs> Mm. This ice cream is really good. 
<laughs> All right, now it's time to make the ramen stir fry. I have all the ingredients over here and some over here. Hi, hi. And James down there. Hi. Apparently, we don't need this because my stir fry sauce, because we're going to be making our own. <laughs> Silly Megan read in the ingredients it said is force the stir fry sauce you need to buy these ingredients not buy stir fry sauce force stir fry sauce buy these ingredients now i have stir fry sauce next i just want to make something okay i'm going to start boiling some water while i cut up the vegetables so i can mm -hmm, yeah. boil the noodles the ramen noodles in this bowl right here so I'll get that going first I'm gonna get the ginger and I'm going to just peel it and then it's supposed to be a thin tablespoon of finely chopped ginger so that's what I'm gonna do to this first Oh, I'm not even blowing the wrong right thing. I'm blowing the wrong one. Thank you for saying that. I wonder why I was getting hot. I'm just going to put that on this plate. That's a heaping tablespoon, probably two tablespoons, probably. Okay, next we're going to do two green onions chopped and white and green parts separated. I actually like this. I don't know if you can tell. But this is from the Stingy Vegan. And she actually gives like the estimated price of what everything costs too. Wow. That's really cool. Okay, I'm going to put these over here with the ginger. Okay, so now I'm just gonna get these, I have two bag, bag balls, bags of ramen, and I'm just gonna get the noodles out. Can I see if I can boil them in there? No. Why? The water is boiling now, so they can go in there, and you only want them to be in there for like one minute, you still want them to be kind of tacky and not cooked all the way because they are going to cook in the sauce also and you can just discard the packet of seasoning because we're not going to use that okay baby you can be very very careful because this hot water can burn you no okay but i just had to get in so i did get my lips so i did burn myself I'm dropping it in softly well, I just didn't want to bum myself. No, that was very unsafe for what you just did. Very unsafe. Sorry. While those are cooking, I'm going to go over to the sink and peel and wash these carrots. Carrots. Funny as well as carrots. While I was uh, washing the carrots, the noodles were actually done so they're actually in the sink pulling off and some or I put them off and with some cold water so they would stop cooking. Now I'm just peeling the carrots. And if you're wondering what peeler I'm using, this Titan ones, they are amazing. They are really sharp. <laughs> If I can find them down, I'll put them down in the description. A link to them. Now I'm just supposed to cut them into rounds. Okay, 
Now you're supposed to use a half a head of a broccoli and you're supposed to cut into florets. And this little guy is so small <laughs> that I'm just going to use the whole thing. And we're supposed to cut, use half of a red bell pepper. Now we're going to combine all the ingredients for the stir fry sauce and I'm going to do one and a half teaspoons of cornstarch. One tablespoon of sriracha. Three tablespoons of soy sauce. One and a half tablespoons of molasses. Oh, mommy, that's good. Oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 oh no, oh no, oh no, 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 oh no. Then you're supposed to have vegetable broth, but I forgot to, to buy it because um, this is supposed to be a vegetarian meal. But um, all, and all I had in the pantry was beef broth, so we're using beef broth instead of vegetable broth. A fourth of a cup and two tablespoons of stock or broth. It's supposed, mm -hmm. to, be, it's supposed to be broth or stock, but I had broth. to get two tablespoons of natural flavored oil. I'm just gonna use some olive oil. And you're gonna put it in a, either a wok or a large pan. You're gonna heat up the oil over medium high heat. All right, now we are going to add the ginger. It probably could be a little bit harder, but I'm impatient. <laughs> the white part of the onion, the garlic, and we're going to stir for 10 to 15 seconds constantly, not browning. Now it's time to smell good, Mommy. Mm -hmm. mm, I like the smell. Do you like the smell? Yes. Now we're going to add the carrots and broccoli. And we're just going to stir and fry until they soften. Now I'm going to add the pepper and zucchini. And I'm just going to continue to stir fry until all the veggies are crisp and tender. Alright, now I'm going to add the noodles back to the pan. <laughs> And can you hand me the sauce, please? Okay. 
Now we're just gonna let it simmer, stirring until the sauce is thick and covers the noodles and veggies. Now I'm gonna stir in the green tops of the green onions and then I'm gonna serve it up. Pretty good. I think, it's, I think it looks pretty good too. You want to come over here and try some? It looks very good. Is there a veggie you want? Do you want a carrot or broccoli or zucchini? Um, I would I would uh zucchini because I didn't know if I tried a zucchini. Well, I keep trying new things, so it's kind of hot. Let's go with it. Oh. Okay. Not as good as I thought it would be. You don't like it? I mean, I do, but it's not as good as I thought it would be. Okay. Apparently, he doesn't like it. Alright, let mommy try it. I like it, but it's very spicy. I like it, but it's very spicy. Well, I don't really like spice. So maybe <laughs> put less racha in it. I do really like spicy in it. Yeah, that's probably why you don't like it. If you don't, if you like spice, then you probably like it. Yay. But. This is my thing on your head and down. But no, I mean it tastes good, it's just kind of spicy. Yep. So, but besides that it tastes, whoa. <laughs> besides that it actually tastes really good. That's, that flavor is good. Just if you don't want spice, either take out the sriracha or just do less of it. All right, James. You ready? Yeah. What are they supposed to do? Um, um subscribe. Go give it a thumbs up. Give a thumbs up, subscribe, hit that bell, so you never miss any of our videos. But if you do miss any of our videos, go and find them. Me, 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 I'll be. Whatever that means. All right, <laughs> thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. Bye. Bye. Yeah.